welcome back to my little corner where today we have yes oh yes but it's not gold this time it's silver hmm. it feels a little heavy <laughs> i'm already like what's in it i want to know i haven't seen any spoilers for this month's bag so this is august bag yes oh yes <laughs> it's a subscription in which you get some beauty products usually full size and it is fairly comparable to BoxyCharm, not quite as much, but it also doesn't cost quite as much. The link down below is an affiliate link, so when you guys sign up, I get a book. Like literally, I get a dollar for each person that signs up. So <laughs> I'm dying to know what's in here, if there is another eyeshadow. I fell in love with IBY because of Yes Oh Yes. Um, I, or yes, can you say just Yes Oh Yes instead of Yes Oh Yes? But I fell in love with IBY because of this subscription. I actually went ahead and jumped on an Ipsy offer where you got another IBY palette for 10 bucks, which is amazing because on their website, they're $20. I found amazing value in this bag last month. Let's see if this month is the same. All right, guys, I'm gonna let you guys have the first peek, I think. So, I'm trying not to look at the view screen, so I don't know if you can even see anything in there, but that's all we got in there. I'm just gonna pull out the first thing without looking. Okay, so this is, I've never heard of this brand. I'm guessing Laqua and Company. It says Cloud Lip. Hmm. It says it is an airy matte lipstick, full coverage that feels light as a cloud. This highly pigmented lipstick is a matte finish for long lasting, fluffy, pouty lips that stay put. They almost tongue twisted me there. Ooh, is that a rose gold top? Ooh, that is pretty. Is that not like just so freaking pretty? It's like all rose gold, the whole package. Ooh. Which side opens here? Ooh, I see, I see. And then it twists up, yes it does. Ooh, that is cool. It's like a full on lipstick. I thought it was going to be a lip gloss. Oh, damn. That, that almost looks like that back lipstick I just got. The bubble gum that I got out of my birch box. Do you guys see that? Holy cow. <laughs> that is really, really pretty. It's really bright, but I think I could pull that off. Why do I always do this? I'm such a kid. I got to see it on. For a matte, it does feel like creamy and like not dry. Hmm. I think we leave that on. What do you guys think? I will try and link these products down below if I can find them. Um, some of them may be Amazon affiliate links. Those are girls trying to make some money. One buck at a time, right? Let's see what's next. What is this? This feels weird. Okay. Okay, this is weird. Oh, is this like a blotting paper? Oh, okay, Natural Tree Blotting Paper. It's by Sorme. I've heard of this uh, brand before. I've gotten something. Was it an eyeliner? A lip liner? It was some kind of liner, maybe? But anyway, Sorme Blotting Paper. That is cool. I've never had blotting paper. I'm going to go ahead and put this away for my cruise because I feel like I will need to blot while I'm on my cruise. I just hit myself in the face. That's neat. Okay, are these our papers? Are there papers? Oh no! Okay, so found the paper in there and it tells me what's on there, so I'm not gonna look. <laughs> I'll go over pricing and stuff. I like being surprised. So the thing I pulled out with the card is another facial sheet mask. I love sheet masks. I really do, and I've gotten better at putting them on to where they stay put. That was the problem I was having with them initially but they do such a good job like hydrating my skin. I absolutely love them. My husband also loves taking pictures of me with them on. So I, have, I assume like 10 years from now, he's gonna have some collage video that's gonna go viral and I'm gonna be that girl with face masks. Anyways, this says ultra moisturizing infused with argon oil and it's eco-friendly. Leave it on for 10 to 20 minutes after you have a nice clean face. You may be ready for a night of partying and celebration, but is your face? Make sure you can stand out from the crowd and start prepping your skin now. Create a perfect canvas for foundation application with pre-party preps, silky lightweight blend of argan oil, orange peel oil, super fruit extracts, 
rice extract, and honey to energize, hydrate, brighten, and prime your skin for a flawless and velvety smooth finish. So this is kind of like before makeup. I'm gonna put this in a get ready with me box, right? And we'll do it the next time we get ready. We'll do this first. That'll be different. What else is in here? Ooh, a brush from Crown Brush. Dude, yeah, that's how you do it, yes, oh yes. Um, I mean, I'm already pretty happy with what I got. So let's see. This is pretty nice. Ooh, this is a nice little uh, blush brush. Perfect. So there is the brush. I mean, ah, oh, this is already such a good deal. I love it. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. There's a palette. Who is it? Don't tell me. Okay. Oh, Beauty Creations. This is the Cali Set palette. I think I've actually looked at this bad boy. Oh my god. I have. I've looked at this palette. There's a mirror in there. I am loving these colors. I have been stalking a couple palettes that have these shades in it. Um, a Colourpop palette. Mm -hmm. Yes ma'am. Holy crap. You guys know I love my palettes. So far this is the second month where I've gotten a palette and I'm totally okay with it being a six shade palette. But we've got nine shades here. Let's watch them. There is the palette. How freaking gorgeous is that? The shade names are really cool. I'll go over them when we sit down, but oh my gosh. Like the second shade, the light pink. That is so freaking beautiful. I've been dying for a palette with these shades in it. Oh, I'm loving them. They swatched absolutely beautiful. I did build up the mattes a little bit more just so you guys could see them. Um, but I prefer a mat, you know, that's kind of buildable. So we've got shade names like Calabasas, Hollywood, DTLA, I'm guessing that's downtown LA, Sassy, Martini, Westwood, Melrose, Cocktail, and Valley Girl. And I love like this like embossment around the palette. The names are on the palette. We got a mirror. Holy crap. This is pretty awesome. Um, Beauty Creations, I hadn't tried. I don't think I've tried a full palette from them. So, um, yeah, now I found out that IBY and Beauty Creations all have really, really great pigment. Also, cruelty free. So, if anybody's wondering if it is worth it, it is worth it. Definitely, definitely worth it. Let's go over how much they say these, this stuff is worth. So, the crown brush is an angled contour brush and it is normally $22. The Sorme blotting paper is a $12 item. The L'Aqua & Co Cloud Lips, $20 item. The Masquerade Pre-Party Sheet Mask is a $12 item. And last but not least, the Beauty Creations Cali Set Palette is a $28 item. Now granted, these are full MSRPs. However, this is definitely worth the, was it $14.99, $15.99 plus shipping? It comes out to less than $18. Worth it! <laughs> so thank you guys so, so much for watching today. It really does mean a lot to me that you guys come back each and every video. Mwah. If you guys are new to my channel, would you think about subscribing before you head out the door? I also like to say hello to a few of my new subscribers each video if I have time. So hello to Harshini, Orange Fish, Lee Berry, and Rachel Perez. Thank you guys so much for subscribing to my, ch my channel. Subscribing to my channel. Thank you. Alright guys, I'm going to let you go. I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye!